Hello there. Well, I'm back. And I'm back at the allotment. I've been a well earned brew because I've been busy. I've nipped down and I've made some. Well, I've not made them. I've set them up though. These boxes. You see them there. And that is for next year. Because next year will be my third time. Third season of growing. And I didn't have a clue when I came here. In fact, I actually thought, flipping heck, what have I done? And even the wife, when I, I, I said, hey, I've got an allotment, come and have a look. She looked at it and she went, no, what have you done? And I persevered. I've always wanted to learn how to grow stuff. I'm, I, I'm, I'm interested in growing stuff, especially in this day and age. I want to learn how to become a lot more self-sufficient. And trust me when I say that there's nothing tastes better than the vegetables you've actually grown yourself. It's amazing. The carrots, the taste of carrot. The potatoes, the potatoes are great. I gave them neighbours and everything. The raving about them, family. <sighs> They were cracking spuds, they're the best spuds I've ever had and so on and so forth. And they are. They really are a lovely potato that I've grown. And I've never documented on 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 coming down to the allotment. I've never got my camera out and said, oh, today I'm going to plant some so some onions and this is how I'm doing it because I'm far from an expert far from but if I can show you the newbie that's a little bit anxious like we all were when we take things on like this what I'm actually doing that I think might help and not only that, there's millions of YouTube uh, channels dedicated to allotments and I don't want my YouTube channel to be dedicated to anything apart from my interests of which growing the allotment is one of them but let me just show you this and this is the 21st of September look at them <clears throat> now those strawberries were given to me and these strawberries are the ones that I took uh, from the runners as they're called and this is my first time of actually being successful because I tried it the very first time and it failed my carrots, I grew carrots the very first time, they failed. Uh, onions went in the ground directly the first time, they were from onion sets. And the weeds overran me and I ended up pulling weeds up and pulling onions up as well. And it dis uh, disappointed me somewhat. But these are all the trials and errors and these boxes <clears throat> because 
the weeds, the weeds got me. And they're forever coming up. It's a, a major problem in the gardening world, apparently. Weeds. So, I'm going to do things a little bit differently. And I'm going to document it and show you exactly what I'm going to do. And I'm going to do it. Instead of just saying, oh, I'm going to do this. I'll actually do it and hopefully record it and uh, show you guys how to do it or what I've done I wouldn't show you how to do it because everybody from what I've picked up everybody does things differently everybody it doesn't matter but some of them will say you want to do this you want to do that you want to do this well you want to do what you think's best but appreciate the fact that some people are trying to help you and not sort of tell you what to do especially on an allotment I've found but we'll see how we go on and I think that'll be a good idea that and explain what I'm doing and why I'm doing it and show you some of the books that I'm taking my knowledge from because what you've got to do in my opinion is you've got to read about it you've got to actually do it and then you sort of learn yeah that's about right anyway in the meantime take care bye bye now